It's an issue that almost all of us have to deal with at one time or another. Delays on either the roads or the rails. The issue of transportation problems front and center for the gubernatorial candidates who faced off on that issue in North Haven this morning. News 8 Stephanie Simone in North Haven this noon with details of that story. Stephanie. Keith, of course, with the election less than two months away, the candidates took the opportunity to poke some jabs at one another. But we boil down their answers to some of the biggest issues like 95, Metro North, and whether or not they would bring back tolls. If you travel the state, you know relying on these roads and rails can steer you into congestion. That's why gubernatorial candidates Governor Daniel Malloy and Republican nominee Tom Foley took to the podium, addressing the roads and rails at a transportation forum in North Haven. Each navigated the same questions, including how to improve traffic on Interstate 95. I think there are things that we can do, like what we're doing in Norwalk, reconfiguring some of the entrances and exits. We can make these things happen, and I, I don't know what the answer is. Uh, probably There are probably people in this crowd who know a lot more about what the answer is than, than I know. But I know it's a problem that needs a solution. Next, it was whether or not they'd invest billions of dollars to try and make Metro North safer and more reliable. We've got to make those investments, uh, and I am making those investments. If we can get control of our fiscal situation, these kinds of projects become affordable. Lastly, both say they would consider bringing back tolls. It would be for things like uh, widening uh, 95. It would be for things like building out 11. I think we might consider tolls as a traffic management tool, but only, only if whatever uh, revenues come from that are a direct offset to the gas tax. So whose answers will resonate with viewers? or voters rather, that will be decided on election day, November 4th. We are live in North Haven. Stephanie Simone, News 8.